Welcome students and family. In this video, I'm gonna teach you something about Prolog. So what I'm gonna teach you is Prolog has the capability, capability, capability to use lists as part of its data structure structure means so there are, from what I understand the basic lists are as follows you can have an empty list like that so in brackets empty on the, and you can have a list of numbers one two three four five in brackets a list of numbers or you can have a list of atoms also called symbols like apple banana cherry or you can have a mixed list of atoms numbers and so forth for example hello 42 world so how, how do you define a list in prolog first you have to give it a name the name that I'm gonna give it in this case is gonna be my list and in open parentheses and inside brackets you're gonna put your list so for example one two three four five that's a list of numbers so let's start with the basic one a, an empty list so a list is composed of a head and a tail head is the first element and tail are the remaining remaining uh, elements of the list so for an empty list what do you think are the elements well empty list that means no elements so let's see what happens when we run the query when we try to grab the head for H and T for tail let's see what it gives us so that's how to access and how to access a list okay 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 so when I try to access the head and the tail of the list I should get false and that is correct because there is no head or tail an empty list is empty it has no head or tail now let's change the list we're talking about let's talk about a list of numbers now we compile now let's run the query what do you think the head is gonna be the head has to be one because that's the head the first element and the remaining element which are the tail should be two three four five let's see what it gives us head is one correct and tail the remaining elements which is returned in a list two three four five that is correct so now let's change it to uh, a list of symbols Okay, so what do you think the head is gonna be? The head is gonna be apple and the tail is gonna be banana and cherry. Compile, save. Let's see, run the query. The head, apple, correct, and the remaining elements, the tail, banana and cherry. That is correct. Now let's do a mix list. And let's see what we get. Okay. So we compile, save, okay. Okay, so what do you think the head is gonna be? The head is gonna be hello and the tail is gonna be 42 and world. 
let's see if that's the case that is correct the head is hello and the tail are the remaining elements which are 42 and world 42 is a number and world is a symbol or an atom called atom so we are correct so this video was about teaching you how to define a list in prolog and how to access a list by creating such a query and the way that I created the query was as follows h and as follows this here bracket h uh, line t close bracket I hope you like my video and you learn a lot and I hope to see you next time don't forget to subscribe you re I really appreciate you your help means a lot to me Thank you very much.